All right, so we're gonna find the area in the perimeter of this rectangle on the coordinate grid. And in order to do so, we are going to start with the distance formula by writing that down. So if you remember the distance formula is the square root of, we take the X's and we subtract them in square, and then we add it to the difference of the Y's squared in the same exact order. Okay, so we're gonna start by finding the area and perimeter. In order to do that, we're gonna find these sides and it is a rectangle, so we really only have to find two sides. So let's go ahead and label and we'll find the short side first. We'll say that we have point A and that we have point B, okay? Um, so we're gonna follow out the distance formula and what I'm gonna do is I'm going to subtract the X's so I'm going to come over, subtract the x's, then I'm going to subtract the y. So I'm going to write the distance equals to the square root, and I'm going to subtract the x's. So 1 minus 3 squared plus, and then I'm going to subtract the y's, um, which are going to be 5 minus 3. I'm going to write 5 minus 3 squared. Now from here, it is literally just going ahead and breaking everything down. So the square root of one minus three is negative two squared, five minus three is two squared. And then we just keep working our way down and we get the square root of negative two times uh, squared is four plus two squared is four, or we get the square root of eight. And when we do this, we can come over to Desmos and just type in, well, what is the square root of 8? Type that in and we get 2.828 or 2.83. So this is going to be 2.83, which also means that this over here is 2.83. Now, once we have that, we're going to use the distance formula to find the longer side. And we can use any points on the longer side. To make life easy, I am going to go ahead and use point A again. Um, and then I am going to also go ahead and use this one. We'll call this point C down here. And we do the exact same thing we were working on. We start by subtracting the x's. So 1 minus negative 5. So I'm going to write that 1 minus negative 5 squared. There's our x's. Then I'm going to add the difference of those y's. So let's say five and negative one. So I'm gonna say plus five minus negative one squared. And then once that's done, I'm gonna take the square root. And so let's go through and just simplify everything out. So I'm gonna do two negatives make a positive. So one plus five is six squared plus two negatives here make a positive. So that's five plus one, which is six squared. We still got to take the square root. And then we do six squared and six squared, which is 36 plus 36, which is gonna bring us to the square root of 72. 36 plus 36 is the square root of 72. Now, once we've got that, we just come over here and we type in the square root of 72 which is going to bring us to 8.48 or 8 point, uh, let's go with 8.9 or 4.9. Okay. So we are going to write down uh, 8.49. We have to remember since it is a rectangle, opposite sides are congruent to each other. Now, when we want to find the area, remember that the area is base times Height. So the area is going to be base times height. And we said this was a rectangle. So that tells us that these are 90 degrees. So all we really need to do in this case is say, well, what is 2.83 times 8.49? That will give us the area. And then when we need to find the perimeter, we're just going to add those up. So remember, there's two 8.49. So I can say uh, 2 times 8.49. And then I'm going to add the two 8.3, so 2 times 8 point, uh, I mean 2.83. Okay. 
Okay. Now, once we've got that, we're going to go off to Desmos. And we're just going to type that in. So I'll find the area first. So 2.83 uh, times 8.49, which is going to bring us to 24.026, or we could say uh, 24.03. And then the perimeter, we're just going to type in the exact same line, which is the sum all the way around. So we just 2 times 8.49 plus 2 times 2.83. And that will bring us to 22.64. So 22.64 is going to be our perimeter. So the distance around is 22.64, and the total area is uh, 22, 24.03.